Shishito peppers. One of many cute appetizers you can put out. Just blister them in a pan with salt and pepper and olive oil. They're not hot. You can get them at a good farmer's market or actually Fresh Direct has them. They taste like small green peppers and occasionally you'll get one that's a little bit spicy. At my farmer's market, they call them one in tens because one in 10 is spicy. But my friend Edgar decided they were called one in tens because one is poison. So what we're gonna do is we're basically gonna leave the stems on just like this and we're just gonna put a little olive oil. Then we're going to salt them as if we were gonna eat them now. A little bit of cracked pepper. We're gonna use the stove top today but you can also make them on a grill. The grill is easier but you need a grill basket in this case, you do not do hot pan olive oil because uh, there's olive oil on it and you want to blister them in the pan. I'll just tell you this little funny thing. The automatic clicker lighters on all stoves in the entire planet and universe break. You'll end up using one of these. I don't care who made your stove. So several people have written in inquiring about these aprons, okay? These aprons are made by a company called Rough Linen, like roughlinen.com. They're, it's run by a woman. She's a complete genius. They have sheets, they have curtains, they have dishcloths, and they have these very cute aprons that are called pinafores, which is an English name because she's English. It is one of the best companies in the United States, in my opinion. I'm gonna take these shishitos and I'm gonna put them in this very hot cast iron pan. You can do it with any pan you have. They should make a noise. And I'm just gonna shake it around a little bit. And I'm going to kind of let them do their thing in there until they're what they call pan blister, which means they'll have black spots on them. You want a nice high heat. They have a lot of water, so if you get smoke, you really burned them. I've never done it this way, so I don't know how long it takes. <laughs> they should be served slightly warm. But essentially, you could do this when they're here because it's cute. It's like a cute little job. You know what I mean? Here's an example of one that is blistered. That's pan blistered. So these are beautifully pan blistered. I'm just gonna take a pair of tongs and just arrange them. I don't usually tip them onto the plate because it can, can sometimes tip the plate or it can put a lot of oil on the plate. You don't want these to be too oily. Finishing touch. You wanna arrange these with a little bowl for people to put the stems in. Otherwise, they don't know what to do. And what I like to do is eat one. Oh, 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 and put the stem so they know what it's for. A little bit of lemon juice, a little bit of salt. I grow these, uh, I also grow these, and it's really amazing. These are very good. A little bit of pepper. And this is a true appetizer, you know? Like it's the perfect thing to make you want to eat more food. Little lemon wedge. People know that they can squirt more lemon on if they so desire. These are superb shishito peppers. One is poison. Oh!